After breakfast, the fourth day of your vacation begins with a tour to Aswan High Dam and Philae Temple. Built between 1960 and 1970 to control the annual flooding of the Nile, the dam is an incredible feat of engineering that measures 364 feet in height and 12,562 feet across. You can find out about its construction, and the controversies that surrounded it, at the Aswan High Dam Visitors Pavilion. One of the effects of building the dam was the creation of Lake Nasser and the flooding of a vast area of land including several important ancient temples. Amongst these was Philae Temple, which was relocated block by block to higher ground on nearby Ajilkia Island. During your visit to Philae, your guide will explain its connections to the goddess Isis and how the 30th dynasty pharaoh Nectanebo I was the first to start work on the temple complex. Today it bears evidence of additions by rulers of the Greek, Roman, and Byzantine periods. Afterwards, return to the ship for an afternoon cruise to Edfu. Lunch will be served en route before making a stop at the Temple of Kamombo. The temple dates back to the time of King Ptolemy VI Philometer, who ruled during the 2nd century BC. It is unique amongst Egyptian temples because of its double design with two identical sides dedicated to the crocodile god Sobek and falcon god Horus the Elder respectively.